Hey guys, today I'm going to show you a simple way to convert an After Effects composition into a sprite sheet that you can import into Unity. So what I have right here is a simple 4 second idle animation loop of a dude from my game. I made the shapes in Photoshop and animated the motions right here in After Effects. And now I want to convert that into a sprite sheet. What we're going to do is export every single frame of this animation loop as PNG stills. And the first step is going to involve changing a few things during rendering. So we're going to go to File, Export, and Add to Render Queue. Then we'll be shown the render queue, and the most recent order will be highlighted. Here you have options like changing the location and prefix of the output files, but what we're looking for is within the output module, so click on the blue text next to it. What we want to do here is change the format to a PNG sequence, which will give us an image for every frame instead of a video. We also want to change the channels from RGB to RGB plus alpha. The alpha channel is just the transparency. Without it, anything transparent will become solid white. After that's done, you can navigate to the target folder and check out the PNG stills, which you can use to animate in Unity. But to make our lives easier, we're going to turn them all into a single sprite sheet. And for that, we're going to use a program called Gluit. Gluit is a free software that runs on Windows, and I'll leave the download link in the video description. There are other sprite sheet packer software available, but Gluit is the most convenient one for me. Once you have Gluit up and running, just add the PNGs using the Add button, and you'll be able to see Gluit adding all the images that you want to put into a sprite sheet into the left window. Then pick a number of columns for the sprite sheet's grid, click Gluit, check out the preview, then save the image. Now all that's left to do is to load up Unity and import the sprite sheet into your game's assets folder. And this can be done by just dragging and dropping the file into Unity. Now to Unity, that file is still just a single image. So what you have to do is click on the sprite sheet and then change the sprite mode from single to multiple. After that, you have to go into the sprite editor and slice up the image. I'm going to use grid by cell size mode here because I know that all of my frames are 80 by 80 pixels. So after inputting the dimensions, click slice, zoom in and give a quick glance to make sure that everything is fine. And then just hit apply. At the bottom of the screen, you'll see that Unity now recognizes the sprite sheet as multiple images and I can select those images and turn them into an animated sprite. After changing the sample rate to match the After Effects composition, the animation should look exactly the same as it did in After Effects.